Defense is at a three hitter offense with a back row setter. We have the left front blocker split between the middle and right side attacker. By being in this position, the blockers are able to play their positions without fear of the setter attacking the ball since he or she is back row. Also note that the back row defenders are up closer to the net in case of an overpass or a quick attack out of the middle front position. The D-quick, or slide set, as it is often called, is very difficult to stop. It is normally run when the setter is front row and the middle hitter comes from the middle of the court behind the setter all the way to the antenna. Normally you will see the left front and middle front blocker bunched in the middle of the court when the hitter starts the slide approach. When this happens, the left front blocker must shuffle along the net and try to stay ahead of the attacker while still facing the attacker. We use the shuffle step on this approach since the left front blocker must be able to jump at any point along the net. The back row defenders must hold their positions and turn to face the attacker. The left front blocker must try to get outside to the line and then press back inside to block since most slide sets are attacked cross court rather than down the line. When designing a team defense, every coach must think about how they will transition from defense to offense. I would like you to keep a few concepts in mind. First, great team defense comes from a high level of individual player skill. You will need to spend a great deal of time on digging and blocking and defensive teamwork if you expect to have a successful team defense. Also, don't forget that your team defense oftentimes starts with your team serving, so the better you serve, the weaker the other team's passing, the more chances you have to score points on defense.